Just okay, so ahead. here is my husband, and here is the product we're going to be trying on him. Can you take off your glasses so people can see? And he didn't know that I was going to record him, but I think we're only going to do one eye to see if it makes a difference. Should we do one eye? No, both. Hey guys, it's me, Christian Marie. We are reviewing a eyelid lifting serum today in this video. This is really exciting. I have tried this for multiple days. There are going to be different days throughout this video. So you guys stay tuned because there are tricks to how to use this. Is this stuff awesome? I'm just excited. That's all I'm going to say. This is by Paracone MD. It is called Eyelid Lift Serum. That's what it says. And is that what it does? Oof. You guys are going to have to stay tuned to watch. But please listen to the whole video because there are things that you have to do for this thing to work to its maximum potential. Let's go ahead and just roll on over to that video right now. Okay, guys, so this is me in the shower, right? I just showered, bringing my hair out, as you can see. And you can see how much extra skin I have on my eyelids. And it used to not be like that when I was younger. It used to be more like, like this. And now that I've gotten older, I have that, you know, where it wants to droop. And I don't have as much, like I used to be able to see my eyelid so much more, as you can see. And I don't have that anymore. So this is going to be the first night. So this is me without makeup. You guys can see what my eyes actually look like. And this is going to be the first night of me trying this, okay? So the directions say, gently pat into eye area using ring finger use morning and evening so i just showered Ugh. sucker was a little expensive so i'm a little nervous to use it i'm thinking it's probably super powerful but you never know because some some products are really expensive and they don't do jack diddly so uh i'm gonna put right here and right here that's it, right? Super, it's a small bottle. Not super, super tiny, but it's small. Anyways, so I'm patting it in, and especially right here, um, it has a sensation to the skin, I will say that. Like, it's not burning at all. You can just feel that it's, for me, I would describe it as like, like a warm feeling almost. So it's weird. It's not warm to the touch. You just kind of get this like, you know, when you put like um, one of those icebreakers in your mouth and you get that to your mouth. It's not, it's not literally hot, but it's, but you can feel the sensation. So you kind of feel the sensation. I don't know if that description made any sense to anybody. If you guys can relate, it's very late at night, but um, <laughs> that's the only way I could describe it. You actually feel this. So I'm not taking it under. I'm just taking it on the outside where you would get crow's feet. And mostly up here where I have all that stupid extra skin. Oh, you know what? Since this is the first night, I'm going to take a picture. And then I'll take a picture because I don't move my camera from this position. So here's the photo. So let's see in a few weeks if I'm like, ooh, like I got an eye lift. I don't know. This once again is eyelid lift serum <laughs> okay i'll see you guys in a few days and i'll do some check-ins uh every now and then to show you and to tell you if you know it changes in the way that it feels once you you know some products you use it for a while and then your skin starts to feel different or the product starts to feel different on your skin i don't know i will see you guys soon okay before i forget i do want to say that it does dry down look at this i only feel that like you have something on the eye and like like it's you know, look, like I have no, I can't slide. I can slide here. I cannot slide there. So there is definitely, it almost feels like you have a tacky, well, is it tacky? It's, yeah, it's a little tiny bit tacky. You saw how my skin kind of came up right there. So yeah, just a little bit, I guess you could say. I was going to say not tacky, but you just, you could feel that you have something on the eye. feels to me like a little tighter. I know it sounds weird. That's the first time you're putting it on, but I feel like, like my eyes are a little bit tighter, you know, like, uh, almost like you put a glue on your eyes and then it dries. It's at least how I feel. Good morning. Good morning. So this is what my eyes look like when I wake up. I've been up for about 
uh, 45 minutes. Let's take a picture, see if we see a difference. Okay, so here is my husband, and here is the product we're going to be trying on him. Can you take off your glasses so people can see? And he didn't know that I was going to record him, but I think we're only going to do one eye to see if it makes a difference. Should we do one eye? No, both. Are you sure? Let's yeah. See. I'm All right. Gonna so look handsome on both eyes. <laughs> okay. Oh, look at me now, and just normal, and I'm going to take a photo. Okay. We'll actually do that again. Open your eyes and do that. Oh, you see how he has this fold right here in his skin? We're going to see if it tightens his skin because as he's gotten older, you can see. Younger. Yes. Yeah, as he's gotten more mature. Mm -hmm, exactly. You can see this, what I'm talking about. Okay, close your eyes. So it's just a very small amount. Just relax. You look like you're kind of squinting there. Yeah. And when you do this, you want to go up. <clears throat> Till it absorbs. Oh, brand new. 20 years younger. Very funny. <laughs> Okay, so Eric has had it on for like 20 minutes. Let's see what his eyes look like when he takes off his glasses. Look at me. Do I be looking at the camera? Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's, let's compare and see if there's a difference. Okay. Okay, so here is Eric, right? It's been like 20 minutes. Close your eyes. Look at this. So remember what we were talking about, his skin? It had that, that fold right here. Close, close, close. No, don't, just relax. It had that fold right here. Look. The fold is gone. That that it was clear as day that fold right here. Is the skin close close? The skin is still obviously you can see it's loose, but it's not as loose as it was. It's almost like it shrunk the skin and open. You can see more of his eye lid. It's just, it looks so much more smoother and tighter. Does it feel different? No, it just feels fresh, but not... What does that. fresh mean? I don't know, like when you put the cream and then it dried out and it's just fresh. That's the only thing I feel. Okay guys, so I'm in the kitchen and I just want to say I got back from the gym. I'm talking funny because I bit my tongue. I just got back from the gym, right? And I saw Eric. I haven't seen him for a few hours. And his eyes look so much better. I'm going to videotape him. But I wanted to tell you guys this um, first. Because I don't want him to feel like, um, you know, feel bad about his aging or anything like that. But his eyes look like they're, how should I say, like they're more awake like they're they're wider they're open more i mean you'll see what i'm talking about um but i don't want to make him feel self-conscious about his loose skin on his eyes because his skin is like it doesn't even i mean mine at least bounces back even though i have quite a bit up here and yeah i've been using it as well but that's the first time him using it i just don't want him to feel insecure about his eyes so I'm just gonna say, oh, I'm gonna give you guys an update and show you guys what his skin looks like. Don't squint, just look at me normal. Now you're looking at me normal and there's like a huge difference in your eyes. Look that way. So you can get close, make a, take a picture. And then the other way. And then look at me. 
they look good. I didn't realize that this uh, eyelid lift serum is supposed to be for the top of the eye and underneath. And so Eric and I are gonna go to an event, a celebration of life, and I'm gonna show you what his under eye area looks like and the top of it. And we're gonna put this on right now and see if it does a difference like it did on the top, that it does, it, will it make a difference on the bottom? I don't know. Okay, so I'm gonna put it on the under eye area and on the top, and we're gonna see what it what it does. Okay, so we just applied it. Does it feel any different, or does it feel like nothing? Right now, it doesn't feel like anything. Okay, we'll come back in the. Yeah, I ordered you um, a. Um, you guys doing scheduling and, and everything, you know, from linen, linen, pulling linen, linen, setting up uh, everything. Look here. Uh, don't, yeah. don't squint. Hola, hola, hola. Don't squint. My eyes look so beautiful. <laughs> Okay guys, so I'm sitting here reviewing the, reviewing the video, reviewing the photos, and this is what I gather. So I gather that um, the product works so much better once you're out of the shower or when you're in the shower and you've already washed your face and your pores are open, the product seems to absorb more into the skin, giving it more of a lift. I do notice that you do have to work the product upwards and you can't be like this when putting it on you actually have to lift your eyebrows up and you have to work it into the skin when they're already up we've tried this a few different days a few different times and this is what you're going to do this is how you're going to get the best result for example tonight um and i know you guys saw eric change his shirt like three times the first one was him trying on outfits with the blue one the the one at the party was with the black one and that's what he decided to wear and then the i think the peach one is what he's wearing after we get home um and i know if you look at the pictures there is a significant reduction in his bag significant if you look at the photo to the left side of the photo if you look at this bag how it droops pretty far down that's a significant reduction but i do not believe that it really affected the top of the eye because he was not showered. He had been working all day long, came home and changed and we went to this function. Now, if he was showered and that steam would have opened his pores up more, the product would absorb more and we would have had a better reaction to the skin that he had the first time trying it when I blindsided him in bed with the video. So when he, when you shower, so, when you shower, you're gonna see a big difference. So the only downside I would say to this product is that you literally have to shower to get the maximum results and then apply it. So if you shower at night, like I shower at night, uh, and you have oily eyelids, let me just tell you, you, I can't use it. I can't use it. I'm a person who showers at night. I have oily eyelids. So I felt that it was going, oh, can they just stop closing and opening the door? Sorry. Anyways, so like the reason I'm saying I can't use it at night is because I have oily eyelids. So when I would wake up the two, three nights that I tried it in a row, I would have this like, I would wake up with like a little bit of a irritation of a burning sensation within my eye. And I truly, truly feel because my eyelids are so oily that the product maybe runs or because I... I'm a side sleeper and I do this, like I'm probably pushing it more into like my eyelashes and it's probably running into my eye and that's a negative. But if I'm going to shower in the morning, apply this on and then wait for it to dry and then put my eyeshadow primer that I normally wear because I have such oily eyelids and eyeshadow primer is gonna dry it. It's gonna, I'm gonna have the product and then my oils are gonna dry and stay put. This is gonna give you so much better of a result. So unfortunately, you're gonna to have to shower in the morning if you're wanting your eyelids to look up and beautiful all day. It did a huge reduction after he had showered in his skin quality. Like you saw like on this eye right here, how he had that crease and the crease just went, it went away. You could actually see his eyelid, but tonight when we did it and he had not showered, you could totally, totally see 
like like the skin wasn't tight like it was the first time around so that is honestly my uh, my um my honest non-biased opinion do i think this product is amazing honestly truly i really do but there are those little stipulations that you will have to do you have to put it on after your skin's dried and you've showered because your pores are open and just so you guys know you really don't want to put it on like an hour after you shower, two hours after you showered because your pores closed. You wanna to try to put it within the few minutes after getting out of the shower and put it on. I think it's a great product, honestly. Um, I just, unfortunately, only reviewed it for a few nights, realized I couldn't do it. And during the daytime, you don't get, like I said, as good of results if you haven't showered. Uh, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was very informative. I hope it lifts some eyelids and makes everybody look youthful and young. And you know what, guys? Even if you're not looking youthful and young, as long as you're youthful and young in here, that's all that matters. Because what is that quote? There's a quote that says, um, it says, we don't stop playing because we grow old. We grow old because we stop playing. So always remember to play. Always remember to remember to keep young at heart because you know what? Life is too short. I don't care if you're watching this and you are 80 years old, Missy. You better get your butt out there and be joyful and happy and have a good time because we're going to get one life and we might as well enjoy it. I love you. Mwah! I love all of you guys. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. You guys have been absolutely amazing. And if you don't mind, please hit that thumbs up button, little subscribe button, and the tiny little bell next to it for notifications of new videos. I'm Christina Marie. I'm out. Bye.